if you are coming for the first time in Zambia and you don't take proper observation on how things happen in this country, you might think as if the country is at war. Like other places where, who are intolerant. We are very tolerant people, we are very peaceful people, but we must not be taken for granted. We think that enough is enough. These people spent 34 days and 34 nights needlessly. This is stupid. Thank you. <laughs> but for those who have been in the country for a long period of time, they have their own way of viewing things. This is the situation that happened today at Choma Magistrate Court, where private media houses were blocked from covering the four UPND officials and the wife to Chief Mukuni, who are accused of abducting with intent to confine Feluna and Milton Hartembo, came up for mention in the Choma Magistrate Court this morning. You know, a, a huge, uh, you know, vehicles, heavily armed to the teeth, as if they are confronting a military, I mean, a, a separatist group, as if they, 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 they are confronting a, an armed militia group, yet they are confronting a former minister, Honorable Seja, who has served this country well. They are confronting two mayors. They are confronting the, 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 the Queen Mother. So what is, what is this kind of uh, drama? We cannot afford to continue to militarize our country, we cannot continue. We accept, we don't accept to turn Zambia into a police state. But speaking now as lawyers, our team stands ready to robustly defend our clients because they are innocent. But speaking now as member of parliament for Choma, during the Press Freedom Day, President Edgar Lungu discouraged all political parties and called on the police to protect the media. But with this picture, police are showing, does it still give hope to the media of being... Government side journalists uh, are more to, to be favored than the way the private uh, sector uh, in the uh, media industry are, are treated. So it is therefore an, an code and he put it to condemnation in the manner through the Zambia police uh, the, the government behaved by banning the private media to cover the event. So now, what picture is it giving the Zambian people whereby the president assured the nation that the journalist will be protected? And when you compared it to what happened when the private uh, media wanted to cover the case of the Hatembo and the wife of the, the chief uh, Mukun. So it is therefore uh, a clear indication that there is no press freedom in this country. It is also therefore a clear indication that they... Because they had come with an evil intention, they went to start discharging tear gas in town and three people in fact, six people were injured, but three severely injured. Three of them ended up being admitted in Choma General Hospital. One of them being a police officer who, you know, fell in a tunnel like this one uh, because of that confusion and got a deep cut on his face. All that was totally uncalled for. We instructed our people not to come to this court hearing protected by the police with this clock ticking towards 12 august 2021 general elections where will the security of the media going to be shikabe john reporting for movie tv news in choma district southern province